More than 67 million people watched the presidential debate earlier this week, but with no audience allowed in, few people saw it in person. And we're getting a firsthand account from someone who had front row seat, the moderator, Lindsay Davis. We caught up with her at an event for KC nonprofit United We. I have to say that it was different from any other debate that I participated in. This was now my third. And normally there's a stage, there are lots of lights, it's bright, it, you have the audience. And this was the opposite in, in that it was intimate and that there was no audience, so no outside noise or interference. And so it's, it, it was just so up close. I think it almost heightened the, the history, the, the historic aspect of it all. And it felt like really serious that, you know, we are just feet away and they're just feet away from each other. And um, I think, you know, you felt the, the weight of and, and the gravity of, of what we were doing. On Thursday, Davis gave the keynote address at United We's annual fundraiser. It focused on the mission of United We, which is advocating for the success of all women and how she's demonstrated that in her own life. I think that quite often we look at boxes of what boys are supposed to grow up to be when they're men and what girls are supposed to grow up to, to be when they're women. And, and I think that we need to at an early age, and, and that's really the point of, of the book that I'm doing, is um, to say be bold and be courageous and dream big. Davis has written six children's books, including her latest, Girls of the World, Doing More Than Ever Before.